So this is unbelievable. Do you know that there are several universities in the UK still accepting applications for fully funded masters and PhDs in different disciplines? And that is what we're talking about today. Different opportunities you can apply for that are still open. Some of them will not be open for long. Some of them you still have time. So it's left to you to do your own due diligence, check the deadlines and start working as soon as possible. These are incredibly generous scholarships still open. Some of them, the deadline is just like a day or two away. For some others, you have like a week, two weeks, a month, depending on the university, depending on the scholarship. So let's dive in without any further delay. But wait a minute. If you're joining us for the first time, you're welcome. This is Victor's channel. It's another day and we have another scholarship. But where have you been? There are lots of videos already on this channel from scholarships on scholarships from around the world so look around i'm sure you find something that catches your interest and if you're a returning subscriber returning viewer thanks for coming back thanks for the constant support and i hope you get a scholarship sooner than later so these are the numerous opportunities we'll be talking about today so i won't go into details to each one but i just show you the scope of um, available scholarships still accepting applications so let's begin with this one this is at the st george st george university of london this university is popular for health related courses so in case you're interested in any of the health related masters even phds i think you should check out this university so there are a number of scholarships here but a number of them are not fully funded you can see this one for instance advanced breast practice so i think you can see it's just three thousand and three thousand is quite small compared to what you'll be paying as an international student but you're paying close to um 25 if not more for masters in health related in the health related um, discipline so let's move on but you can check for others if they have fully funded opportunities this is also three this is also three you might be getting angry with me now and asking where is the fully funded opportunity then but check out this one in global health global health msc so there is a spot for three thousand but yet there is another spot for a fully funded scholarship with a um, living maintenance grant of 17,000. In case you cannot see, it is right here. But there's just one spot for it. You can see here 17,000 for maintenance, scholarship with stipend, and for international applicants only from lower and middle income countries. So this is probably what you were probably interested in if you're going for the scholarship. The only bad news here, the bad news here is that the deadline for the scholarship, I believe is um, the end of this month or the beginning of May. You can always check that, of course. Let me go to, you can always check that study, go to postgraduate um, courses. Let's go to postgraduate study. And let's see um, the deadline if we intend to study um, global health. You can also remove the um, annotation on the page. So MSC Global Health is what we're looking for. And we're trying to check for the deadline. So Global Health, let's load quickly. So this is the page on Global Health. Check the deadline very quickly and see and things like funding as well. So we're going to fees and funding. So it has stated the fees here, but you're looking for fully funded, right? Fully funded scholarship. So this is what I wanted to bring to your attention. The, um, what they call it? The deadline for scholarships. You can see it here, St. George Postgraduate Scholarship. The deadline is on the 1st of May. And this video will probably come to you on the 28th, 29th. So you just have to work full speed to make sure you reach the deadline. So let's move to another one, another school, another look for another scholarship. Hopefully, hopefully for that one there, there is enough time to apply for a scholarship. So this is still 
health related. This is the London School of Hygiene and Tropical Medicine. So in case you're interested once again in health related issues, health related research studies, you should um, dive into this one. So there are still a number of scholarships still open. So just check the status tab and you see open, open. Also check whether it's open to either home or international students or overseas students. For instance, there's something here on climate change, climate change and planetary health. I said it's still, it's still open. So we can just click on this quickly and see what it covers. So you can see um, from here that it covers tuition fees. Let's make this bolder. Tuition fee, um, either home or um, overseas. Um, home or overseas tuition fees. And see it right here. And then your stipend of over 20,000. So you have home and um, what they call it? You have home and um, overseas fees and then um, 20,000 for stipend. Of course, there are several other scholarships here. You can see the number of them open to all students. Those are the ones you want to target and check whether they are open or not. A number of them are already closed. I advertised this scholarship a while ago or the other scholarships that are presently closed a while ago so concentrate on the one open and see if you can apply to any of them there are also phd opportunities of course you can always dig that by yourself go to the funding tab here and find the phd opportunities that are still accepting applications so let's move to another university this is at um, Strathclyde university and if you scroll down, you can see that this university is for those studying them MBA business related courses. And it is fully funded. They are giving five people fully funded scholarships for um, MBA courses and then covers your tuition and your living cost. So this is also very great tuition and living cost covered. In case you cannot see it, a number of people complained. They cannot see my highlighted um, my highlighted text, so I'm um, bringing it more, making it more conspicuous for you. So, in case you're interested in this, you're in the business field. I think this will be interesting to you. So, this opened in December and it is closing um, on the second of June. So, try to apply as soon as possible. The application procedure is well written here, so just check and you will be fine so let's check something else so this is at coventry university i've also talked about scholarships at this university in the past unfortunately a number of them are still open and let's go for them let's go for them why not so remember so this is coventry university to check the application deadline so for this one for instance about um, river systems and pathogens so diseases that live in um, water bodies and that might be prevalent during flooding so you click on this and see the deadline for this one the deadline is on 30th of april so it's often no time almost no time to even apply for this one and the application procedure is there for this one you just need a simple two one second class upper is sufficient and then provide this document they want you to submit and then you're good to go there's just one more day to submit this one a number of you might not meet it so let's check for other ones so let's go back there and check for other available opportunities so we're back to that page so select other ones and see which one is still open and which one is closed see the number of opportunities here let's see if we can get something else there's something about lithium batteries which is still open and this is until the 27th of um, may so there's still a bit of time for this one once again both for uk eu international students and then you can see here what you require and um, how to apply is also written here so it's fully funded covers your tuition covers your um, living stipend so i think you should apply for this as soon as possible if this is your area of interest you can see here fully funded studentship including tuition fees stipend bursary so let's go to another one so this is for 
the ladies in the house so if you're a lady and you're interested in tech related courses computer science artificial intelligence machine learning and things like that um, the way you apply artificial intelligence to other aspects of life like AI and um, drug discovery AI and um, machine learning and science and the rest of them AI biosciences so this is for you fully funded at Queen Mary University London I actually have someone on this channel who won the scholarship um, last year if I have a screenshot of a uh, um, award I'll put it somewhere on this page so there's somebody on this channel who actually won this last year so we have an antecedent for, for this so fully funded you get your living allowance you get, get your tuition covered you get conference grants and yeah this is just this is amazing the application procedure is also written here I think you have to apply both for the um, course and then return to apply for the scholarship also keep an eye on the deadline it's very important there are still a number of PhD opportunities to look at this is at Cardiff University and if you scroll down you see the number of numerous opportunities and remember to use the filter function and we're selecting non-EU non-European students and these are the opportunities 43 of them for non-European students you can see this one the deadline is on the 27th of May so you still got a bit of time 31st of May bit of time so just look around and see if you find something in your discipline you can always use the filter tab for discipline as well to um, filter the, the research so this one you can see fully funded and um, click on it to get more information about it and then what is the what are they saying about funding i will scroll down to see what they say about funding you can see funding over eighteen thousand, and your tuition everything is covered so um they got you covered through and through we still have one more to go this is at swansea university still a number of opportunities and of course you want to pay attention to whether it's open to just uk or uk and um, international other international students so here you can see uk applicants only here you see uk and international applicants so pay attention to that and of course check for your own field of study you can see computer science there's um, aerospace engineering mechanical engineering mm, um, biomedical engineering and the rest of them so you can click on this and see which one is still open and which one you can still apply for you can see a number of them here in different disciplines so when people tell me oh i can't find a scholarship I often ask them have you actually searched and how did i get it very through very simple means we just go through google most times phd studentships type the name of one random uk university and see what is there check whether it's still open or not and it's as simple as that through a simple google search i did the same for cardiff you know phd studentship cardiff university and then i was able to check and a number of things are still open having said that before we go i'll show you this website i've talked about this also in the past where you find phd fully funded phd opportunities so it's called jobs.ac.uk let's click on the phd tab and then you see a variety of funded phd opportunities so for instance if you are into the biological sciences you just click on this biological sciences and you can use the filter function to find funding for funding for international students so it says here for international students there are 48 funded opportunities for biological sciences and of course click on them to make sure that is true and they are open to international students and then check for your area of interest check for um, what the project is all about and then apply as soon as possible so one thing just caught my attention that for this one in particular they said um, you're going to be paying the home rates 
So it means you pay the difference between home and international fees. Well, this is not good enough because the difference is quite large. So for home students, they might pay like 5,000. International students are paying like 20,000. So it means you pay the shortfall of 15,000. So you want to pay, or you want to find a scholarship that cover everything through and through, except you have the money to pay the difference. I think that's important to also mention. So check for the particular funding details of the scholarship. Check for the particular funding details and see whether it covers all your tuition fees or whether you have to pay like a shortfall um, within and um, between home and international fees. So this is full cost UK tuition once again. So you want to look for those just covering also covering international tuition. So let's see whether we'll find any. A number of them here. This is Birmingham City. Okay. Let's see if we we'll find something that covers international fees as well. So it says here that okay, funding for 36 months. Yeah, the amount is here and the um, tuition is here. It doesn't make any distinction between home and international students. So hopefully there is no um such distinction. Your fees will also be paid whether you're home or international. So apart from this website, there's the last one called findaphd.com. It's just in the name. Usually, most of the PhDs here are UK-based PhDs for different disciplines as well that are still accepting applications. You can see the different fields. And then use this funding tab to produce results just for those available to international students. So there are 1,883 positions open to international students. So your duty now is to narrow them down to your discipline. As simple as that, guys, as simple as that. Then check for the um, closing date, check on the funding structure, check for the research content. And that's it is, guys, that is it. I hope this was useful, fully funded masters and PhD scholarships from across the world. Not really across the world, actually across just the, across the UK. Um, they are still open, some of them are closing very soon, others you still have time. So get to work, start putting your documents together and start, hopefully, um, one or two will come in your way. And that's it, guys. In case you've not subscribed to my channel already, this is probably a very good time to do so because many more videos like this are coming your way. You're often the first to know if you're subscribed about these kinds of scholarships and these kinds of opportunities. You often see it here first before probably a day or two days later number of people do copy from this channel i must accept copy from this channel and then post on their on their page so if you want to be the first person to know first i think you stay with us you should subscribe on this channel and you'll be notified as usual we cannot wait to celebrate you so get to work and i'll see you at the top sooner than later bye bye for now cheers